So let us make a multiplication table of 15 by 15 or 10 by 10 or whatever you you like. So this is how we begin it. We first highlight and then if I do a row and a column, yeah, where our initial just are going to appear. That is one up to 13. Another, another one, 14, 15. Yes, that is it. We have filled this row with those cells. So that is our very first step. This is our very first step. Then, after doing that, I make a column with it. Cells just like that, same way. These are values one up to fourteen. So I want to make a multiplication table. I want to make a multiplication table of fourteen by fifteen. So in this place, in this column box. I am going to type this formula equal sign and begin with equal sign. Then uh, F F components of this cell F five. Going to and F then after F we use another sign. Another sign. Side we we click it and then four and you can see it is now highlighted. Well, it's already highlighted. Then I multiply. I'm going to multiply this cell. Question: You click. Uh, you pin. You enter shift. Then eight. Question: That star. Multiply by dollar sign again. Dollar sign E6. E6. Then I'm going to enter. Enter. Is there already? One is one times one plus one. Then copy that formula. That formula. Copied that formula. Let me zoom a little bit so that and this is the formula. Formula equals to F dollar sign five multiply multiply by F multiply by dollar sign E six E six. Okay, once I'm done. Now next. Next, what I do next? What I do next is uh, I'm going to copy formula to the rest, but then <coughs> that is it. I've copied that formula. And this is our multiplication table. Then enlarge a bit so that everything will be seen clearly. Constrained. So that is it. That is how that is how we make a multiplication table. Multiplication table you can make. 10 by 10, which is 10 by 10. See, that is 10. That is 10 by 10. 10 times 10 equals 100. 10 times 9 